The weather is sponsored by the Deerwood Bank, the bank with all the answers. Locations in Deerwood, Brainerd, Baxter, Bemidji, Grand Rapids, Black Duck, North Home, Garrison, and online at DeerwoodBank.com. And now, the weather on Lakeland News at 10. After some really nasty weather early this morning, today kind of seemed tame with just the humid and hot weather. But I'm happy to say that the days of humid and hot weather are near their end here for the area as the cold front is coming in, so we're gonna start seeing some cooler days finally coming starting this weekend. And before we get to that, I do have a picture of some of the damage that happened last night. Here's a tree, this is on the west side of Lake Bemidji, and you can see that the roots actually tore up and took up a stop sign with it, and that's from one of our viewers, Sarah. Currently, right now at the Lakeland Studios, the temperature is at 81 degrees, wind at 3.5 miles per hour, dew point 62, humidity at 60%, and peak wind today was 55.2 miles per hour. That came during the storm. Right now in Brainerd, it is clear skies with temperature at 75, dew point 68, and the wind's getting pretty calm, so it's actually a pretty nice night out tonight. And then right here you can see we've got a flood warning going on right now in Aitken and near Fort Ripley at the Mississippi River. Right now it's just a little bit of minor flooding. It just is a little bit above the flood range. So, and they expect by Sunday it should go back down to normal. And then if we look here, we've got some severe thunderstorms happening in North Dakota. It's possibly it could reach us tomorrow, but the chances of that are happening are very slim. Right now, our eagle eyes, Dewey in Park Rapids, got 0.3 tenths of an inch of rain, but he says the rest of the day was quite sunny and beautiful. Bob in Bluffton said he got 0.8 tenths of inches of rain, but likewise, it was also a sunny day. And then, of course, we've got Chuck in Finlayson, and he said it wasn't quite as miserable as yesterday, but he still says that today qualified as being quite miserable with the heat. And looking at the Brainerd Almanac, today the high was 89. It's just a little bit above the average, low 66, and sunrise at 546 a.m. Here in Bemidji, the high was 93, way above the average, and the low got down to 63 degrees, and sunrise at 544 a.m. Looking at the highs around the state, ooh, that Rosa one isn't quite right. I, I guess it's possible it got to 64, but I, I doubt it. Otherwise, for the rest of the area, we got low 80s, high, low 90s, high to mid 80s going on. And looking at tomorrow, now there's about 20% chance of thunderstorms happening in the northwest part of the state, but for mostly everyone else, it's going to be sunny to like partly cloudy kind of days with highs getting into the mid 80s. In the more central part of the state, Wadena is going to get to 87 degrees, but it's only going to have a 20% chance of having any thunderstorms happening. And that's gonna happen more in the afternoon than in the morning. Tonight, it's gonna to be mostly clear around the area. Low is gonna be of 63. The west wind right now is at five to 10 miles per hour, so it's a pretty calm evening right now. And tomorrow, as I mentioned, it's gonna be sunny for most of the part of the day, but there is that 20% chance of those showers and thunderstorms that are in North Dakota right now coming in to Minnesota. High should be getting around to 86. Looking at our weekend forecast, we got, 20, as I mentioned, 20% chance of storms and showers tomorrow. And on Saturday, we're gonna, that's when the real storm is going to probably happen. It's going to start out partly sunny in the morning, but in, but in the afternoon it's going to get up to 40%, and then by evening it's going to be 70% chance of showers and thunderstorms. But as you can notice, the temperatures are dropping as we're getting into the mid to low 80s, and then on Sunday, 20 to 30% chance of showers and thunderstorms. Extended forecast, it's going to be pretty calm. Monday is going to be, I think, a beautiful day, only getting up to 82 degrees, but it's going to be clear skies, and I think that's going to be some pretty nice weather on a Monday. Too bad we can't move that one over to Saturday, huh? I know. If only. <laughs> if only. Yeah, going to be uh, hot and humid tomorrow again, though, huh? Yeah, but not quite as bad as it has been these past few days. All right, very good. Thank you, Andrew. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.